All right, I'm here. Jesus, don't... Don't sneak up on me like that. Did you find anything out about Sarah, about the woman that I put on your chopper? Nothing. Nothing? Hey, hey, wait, 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 wait. It's gonna take some time, okay? I'm risking my neck here. If anyone the, the back at HQ finds out, the, the, those guys with the guns over there, they'll all order without question. You're all the same question. team, O'Brien. It just looks that way. Look, I don't have time to explain it right now, but... It's why I need your help. My help? Just, look, just take it. It's a, it's a wavelength recorder and some GPS trackers. I just need you to... T We're out of time. Look, I... Shit, I don't even know your name. Deacon, Deacon St. John. Well, look, Deacon St. John, if you want me to risk my neck helping you find whatever her name... Uh, Sarah? Then, yeah, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Okay. Keep the radio close. I'll contact you in a couple of minutes. Here, what do you, uh... One of our helos is heading toward your position now. You have to follow it. Follow it? Why? Just, just go! Don't lose it. Jesus, okay. All right. What's going on, O'Brien? Why am I out here in the shit chasing choppers down for you? The destination's classified. I'm locked out of their files. So I can't give you the coordinates to their LZ. You have to follow them in. Jesus, don't you guys have spy, spy satellites? Shit like that? And not that I have access to, no. I told you one. Locked out. Yeah, I heard you. Please don't lose them. Come on now. Can't let him get too far ahead. Slow down. O'Brien, they're landing! Good. I have their coordinates now via your radio. You better go in on foot. On foot! Remember, you can't let them see you. O'Brien, I'm here. What do you want me to do? You want me to sneak into an LZ filled with heavily armed Kevlar-wearing soldiers who shoot on sight so that you can spy on some asshole wearing a pocket protector? Pocket protector? Really? I have a fucking PhD, asshole. Yeah, which stands for piled high and deep. Do you still have the tracking devices I gave you? Well, I was gonna sell them, but most of us don't have access to shit like, you know, satellites. Place one of them on their helo. Almost all of these filed missions include stops that aren't on the books. I want to find out where they're going next. O'Brien. You don't need to ask. I'm already looking into what records are shut about where evacuees were taken. O'Brien out. This just gotta be it. Jesus, this is taking forever. How are you guys doing out? Before it gets dark. Feel 
Field Note 2071. Checking the traps at Site 14 Alpha. I've confirmed a large male subject with a confirmed albinism mutation. Subject has expected lack of skin pigmentation and reddish eyes. Muscle mass appears to be 40% greater than normal infected subjects. What was it you called them? Bleachers. Well, they're real. Well, this is only the third subject we've been able to study. As noted, their strength and ability to absorb damage make them extremely dangerous to approach. We've noted in other field reports that over a thousand have been spotted in this area. Is causing the mutation. It spread rapidly. Fucking white rain. What the hell, O'Brien? Yeah, that looks like this all the time. What's wrong? I'll tell you what's wrong. Your boys were carving out the guts of a freak while I was still alive. They're not my boys. And what do you care? Aren't you a. What do you guys like to call yourselves? Drifters? Don't you kill the infected for money or whatever shit you barter with? Yeah, I kill freaks, but I don't carve them open while they're still alive and listen to them scream. Did you get my data? Yeah, I got your data. It's getting dark. Okay, I'm uploading it now. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Brian? O'Brien! God damn it, he did it again. O'Brien! Talk to me. Ah, shit, you better be in touch, O'Brien. Hey, I came by to see how the lazy bastard's doing. How you doing, booze man? Are you, are you tired of laying around yet? Boozer. Hey, you can't be in come here, on, Come on, hey, come what's on, going Deacon. on? How's he doing? He needs his rest. Oh. Don't mess around with me, Addy. I asked you, how was he doing? I'm good, I'm good. Uh, not good. Damn, it's cold. The They're not enough. They're never enough. Oh, wait a second, you said that I, I said that we would try. <gasps> Look, all we can do is wait. Okay. All right. Deacon. No, Deacon. there's. Uh, you Deacon. know what? There's Deacon. something I can do Deacon. about this. Stop. I can get. Stop! What? I know you want to smash something. I see that look yes. in your eyes. But you know what? You go right ahead, but you do it out there. Daddy, go. I can... Look. <sighs> there is nothing else you can do. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Please. Just go home. Go home, Deacon. Ugh. <sighs> Dig, dig. So, you gonna make it? Yeah, Schizo, he'll be fine. I just, he needs a few days. Come with me to the lodge. I wanna show you something. I got shit to do. I'm sticking my neck out here. Trust me, you're gonna wanna see this. Just, just listen. A couple of months back, this drifter comes into camp, telling all kind of crazy stories. Said he worked at the airport, was on the ground back in Farewell when shit went down. One night, they were expecting a flight in from Portland, only it never shows up. The plane is doing a haul for the Red Cross. The Red Cross? Yeah, you getting it? Medicine? Doctor shit, cargo hold full of it. Maybe even some of those uh, anti uh, whatever the fucks. Antibiotics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit like that. Just like that. Where? Hey, keep your voice down, will you? Let's talk inside. So this drifter, he's working in the control tower when the plane disappears off the radar. Poof. Now you see it. Now you don't. Right about. Here. South of Mount Washington. That's what he said. It came down intact. A controlled crash or whatever. The guys got to listen to the pilot bleeding out from a broken pelvis on the ground. Okay, so you haven't sent anyone to find this? Nope. Why not? Because the old man won't have it. Iron Mike, what's... Oh, right. 
rippers. <laughs> you catch on quick. Everything west of the Iron Ridge here belongs to Carlos and his merry band of bald-headed freak-alikes. Oh, shit. So you go over there and you get caught? You head north, brother. Otherwise, Iron Mike's treaty with rest and peace goes... Okay. Yeah, no, like no, I get it, I get it. Let me ask you a question. Why are you telling me this? Oh, wait a minute. First off, I'm not telling you shit. You remember that? Second off, you're a goddamn drifter. What am I supposed to do? Follow you around like I'm your little bitch? Keep your ass out of trouble? All right. I have things to do. I get it. You're just a regular stand-up guy, right, Schizo? Just trying to stay alive. Like everybody else. <sighs> hey. You do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, that's all we got. Do you know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying, Schizo. Keep your radio close. I'll be in touch. Schizo, it's St. John. I'm at the border. You see any of my men around? No, Schizo, it's clear. Look, how much time do I got? Time? Time for what? All I know is I got a card game going on with a few of my guys. A couple of them maybe they should be out on guard duty, but I'm letting that slide. If I had to guess, I'd say we'd be playing all night. So until morning, got it, Deacon out.
Thanks. Son of a bitch. Antibiotics. You gotta find me some antibiotics.
Good. Please will fix him up, and then we ride out of here, head north, like he said. Deacon St. John, you there? Deacon, this is Ricky. Over. Damn it, I can't let her know I'm out here. Hey, Ricky, this is Deke. Uh, you're breaking up. I can't hear you. Deke, where are you? I need to get hit. Yeah. Sorry, Ricky. I don't have time for this right now. Wait! That's Deacon. Behind him! You! You! Right up the road. Make sure they don't come back. Now! I heard gunshots. What's going on? We had a run-in with a few rippers, but I handled it. You handled it? What was it? Wow. I should have known. You should have known what? Jesus, Ricky, who's running security here? You know, I ask myself that shit every single day. I'm done here. Good. So what are you doing out here? What am I doing, Dick? Addy told me to come and get you. Why? What? Hold on for a second. Is Boozer okay? I don't know. We gotta go. What's wrong with Boozer? All I know is Addy told me to find you. When I asked around, I found out you and Schizo were heading up here. Now I know why. I don't know what you're talking about. The crash site? The medical supplies? It's no big secret, D. Negotiating with Carlos, making a deal so my camp will split it with the Rippers. No oh, bullshit! What do you mean? I mean bullshit! I was there. At that cargo hold's already been looted. Tracks from the crash site all head south. Now, I've been dealing with the fucking Rippers for months. You can't trust a goddamn thing they say. Now you're sounding like Schizo. Schizo, he put you up to this. He told you about the crash site. Uh, yeah, that's right. Now you're calling me Schizo's errand boy. No? Then how'd you find out about it? A drifter up at Copeland's camp. Like you said, it ain't no big secret. Yeah, right. Well, Schizo's been trying to pick a fight with the Rippers for months. Guess it's lucky you came along to do it for him. So let me ask you something. Can I stop you? Last time I saw you, last winter. You told Iron Mike to go fuck himself, because he wouldn't pay you to bring in survivors. That's not exactly what happened. I remember it pretty clearly. Iron Mike said he'd have nothing to do with slavers. Okay, we never forced anyone to come in against their will. How about Tucker? Same thing true 